Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make the easiest crochet dishcloth, which is perfect for beginners. Best of all, we're only going to use one stitch, the half double crochet. For this project, you will need yarn. I'm using peaches and cream stripey in the color energetic pink. You'll also need a crochet hook. I'm using an H8 five millimeter hook, scissors, and a yarn needle. To start off, we're going to make a loop and insert our hook. I like to wrap the yarn around my pinky and over my index finger to help create tension and control the yarn. Now we'll make our foundation chain. To make a chain, you'll grab the yarn with your hook and pull the yarn through. We're going to make a chain of 22 stitches. When you get to the end, we're going to start our first half double crochet in the second chain. We don't count the loop on the hook as a chain. Instead, we'll count backwards. One, two. Yarn over. Insert your hook into the second chain and pull the yarn through. There are now three loops on your hook. Now we'll yarn over and pull the yarn through all three. And that's how you make the half double crochet. We'll do it again. Yarn over, move to the next chain, insert your hook and pull the yarn through. Now we'll yarn over and pull the yarn through all three. Continue working down the row until you've made a half double crochet in every chain. Once you reach the end, chain two, and turn your work. Now we're going to make a half double crochet in every stitch starting with the first one. At the end of every row, you'll chain two and turn your work. Continue crocheting until you have 15 rows. Once you've finished your dishcloth, you'll chain one, pull the yarn through, and cut it leaving a tail. Using a yarn needle, weave the tail into your work, then cut. Then weave the other tail into your work. And that's it! These dishcloths make excellent gifts and they're so handy to use around the house. They can be used for face scrubs and washcloths too. Okay everyone, that's all for now. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.